Hey everybody, it's Slate Your Life Channel. I got Steve-O here. We're walking through the Miracle Mile shop over to the link because he hasn't gone on a high roller yet. So we're going to go check that out. And while you check that out, check out this old high school jean jacket with my old hard rock pin. That's right. 1990, yo. 1990. Moving on. So I always got to check out my buddies, see what they're up to, see if they're busy. You know, it's just like they're never busy. I know it's a Tuesday evening, but it's just never happening. They're just never pouring out beverages. Bartender's busier. I guess that's good. Robots are not taking over the world quite yet. What, Steve-O? Yes, well, they got this guy over here cranking out the drinks. Yeah. He's got a full bar back here. Right. Maybe she said people just walk up and order it. He put have them make it go get it. Oh. You know, so if or maybe people want to drink fast and these guys are just too slow. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. It just seems like uh seems like that's more happening than the It just seems like you know, he should be uh make it just, you know sending them to over there. What about this the media? Oh, we're good. That's how you handle it, people. That's how you handle it. You just say you're local, keep looking straight ahead, no eye contact, keep it moving, keep it moving. And now we're outside. You know, I was thinking about doing a vlog about how to handle the hustlers and just showing every time I get hit by one what I do. Anyway, Vegas Boulevard. And it drops you off right here. The Bellagio, the Aria, straight across. The Cosmo, that's right. Cosmo's right there. And these buildings throw me off because they're like, they look like they're tipping over. So it's getting uh, evening time, so definitely people watching is a lot more, yeah, full force, more fun. So let's do this. Yeah, it's pretty busy on a Tuesday evening. This is pretty good. Isn't it? I mean, well, I know I normally go in the morning, so. Oh, that guy's. That guy knows what's up. That's not water. I know. I'm up to you. I gotcha. I'm doing the same thing, buddy. All right, now we're walking past the Paris Casino. A pretty cool place to eat while you watch the Bellagio Fountains when they are going on, which they aren't at the moment. CVS is a place to, if you want to get like a cheaper drinkage, probably a good place to yeah. grab one. Yeah. Oh, way cheaper. So our goal is to uh, go, through, you want to go through the Flamingo or just around in front of it? There's that slapping of the flyers. You hear that everywhere you go in Vegas. See some showgirls going up. See plenty of them. Keep on walking, keep on walking. So here's the entrance to the valleys, right over here. And I believe, oh no, that's the go across. You gotta know your pedestrian walkways because you don't want to go across that way. You want to go across this way so don't just start going upstairs just because they are there <laughs> <laughs> you end up in the that, wrong that direction well for us last time. yeah <laughs> here we go street. this is the walkway we, yeah don't listen to steve just kidding. <laughs> here's the walkway we want all right right in front of the cromwell i just wanted to show you a cute little photo op right here at the martini glass and steve just said he always wanted to what I always wanted to go in here and just try my luck because they have this. Uh, everywhere I go, I see these signs that say double to two deck blackjack or oh, okay. single zero roulette. They're supposed to have, try and move better odds. I don't know how true it is. He's doing that thing again where he gets real close up in my face. The vlogging etiquette, Steve O. Yes, I saw you backing up. Yes. 
I don't want to run into somebody. I but. didn't catch on until it was too late, but I saw you backing up. All right, so here <laughs> is, oh, here we go, the link and the high roller. I guess we're not going to go through the flamingo, we're just going to go around it. We've done the flamingo habitat before. Definitely a cool little free thing to see. Bring the kids. If you have any. If you don't, still okay. That's a cool picture though. I always like that sign. Yeah. Alright, let's keep it going. Alright, looks like we are at our destination because we want to go this way. And this time, I'm going to get in line. And this time, I'm going to say we live here and show my Nevada ID so I get a local discount. Because last time, I did not do that. Because I'm a dork. I forget living in Vegas, they offer a lot of local discounts out here, which is awesome. So, I'm just going to show you what I'm seeing here. I got another one of those Starbucks. It's either Starbucks or Amazon I get like from my Verizon phone thing or you get reward up thing. I only got three bucks though, but it's not going to buy me much at Starbucks. Maybe a teaspoon of coffee. Lisa, this time, I wanted to try to avoid the sun glare in my face, so I think it's an opportune time. This is kind of cute. I like that. Alright, this is kind of a cool little place, the tequila bar. If you love candy. I think this is your jam, literally. It's just a cute little promenade, I guess you'd call it. I believe as of right now, this is the tallest Ferris wheel in the world. Of course, things can change. Everyone's always trying to outdo each other, but... We are entering the closeness of the wheel. Don't ask. I have nothing to say right now. And the zip line's straight ahead, right above us, but nobody's zip lining at the moment. All right, there you go. I was trying to face us. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, and then I met you. Oh my, oops, I got the, the Ferris wheel again, so I was going to say something stupid. So, I want to talk so the music doesn't ruin my video, because that's so rude. Anyway. <laughs> Kind of cool. Right, Steve? That's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. No, no, I was just looking at it in and out. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> like, we don't have it in and out. At least look at it. <laughs> it is good stuff, though. I'm not going to lie. Ah, what's with this dude? Hello. That's quite a meal. Look at that. Damn. It's, uh, look what it did for him. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I don't want to do that. I think it's thing. not that healthy. <laughs> The closer we get, the taller this thing looks. But for anyone that's fearful of heights, it's not scary at all because it's a big room and it goes so slow and if you're that scared, you don't have to look out the window if you don't want it, but there's plenty of seats you can sit toward the center. So it's really not uh, a big deal. Alrighty then, here it is in all its glory. Now you can purchase them online off your phone and then show a ticket. Oh, there's two zip liners. They actually start from over there. Anyway, you can purchase the tickets online. They could just scan it. Problem I had was that I didn't look right and I just purchased two adult tickets for me and Sarah, like an idiot, and realized, oh my God, I, I could have paid child prices and I don't know how you would get a local discount on that thing. So we're just going inside. Plus the line is like nothing. So that's perfect. Purchase tickets or redeem vouchers, yeah. So yeah, all right, you can skip the line or you get in line, but it's hardly a line, so. And the other funny thing is if you wear green, because they do a green screen picture, if you want to make your body look like it's uh, invisible, that would be key. All right, let's do this. All right, we are approaching the second floor and there are bathrooms on the second floor in case you have a last minute potty situation. And, there is a bar here, so if you don't want to do the um, the bartender one, which is a little bit more to have all you can drink for a half hour and take a drink home with you, you can purchase drinks here. 
Yes, Steve-O? It's $20 for a bar car. Extra and on top of what we just paid. On top of your ticket, so... But I mean, these drinks are going to be... Well, I guess it would be. I mean, like, you get two drinks, two glasses of wine here. Eight bucks. It's 20, it's and it costs, what, thirty seven fifty for me and you for a local discount mm -hmm. total. And with a local discount, I could have gotten a friend well, in. You, you could have gotten, gotten a friend in for that discount. On the bar? I wonder. Oh. Maybe. Probably. Maybe. Well, let's go. Yeah, so see how it's green screen? Sorry, we had to keep moving along. That green screen, he's like, you'll disappear if you wear an all green suit and that green screen is just going to show your head and well, your hands and stuff. But it's kind of funny, so if you guys want to check that out. We skipped the line. We didn't want to do pictures, so you can not get in that line for pictures and just go straight to the ride, in which we are doing. So this is our view from the line. Is it line up there? Oh, well, that's the end of the zip line. It starts on the other side and you exit over here. And not too shabby for the line here. It's just the two uh, parties before us. And actually, these things hold a lot of people. All right, here we go. 550 feet. You kind of get an idea how fast we're moving. Yeah. We filmed something. Like, we filmed the railway. I'm filming the railway. something. <laughs> so, yeah, it, honestly, and look how, like, spacious it is in here. So there's two areas to sit. This is Plenty of standing room. You can hang on to the rails. It's very smooth. So if you're afraid of heights, if you're just going because everyone else is forcing you, you can always just sit here and just close your eyes. And you really doesn't feel like anything. You down, like or you can look down and on your death. <laughs> or that. No, I'm just kidding. Ooh, what are they doing? This is building stuff. Stevo, tell me. Somebody yeah. told me to talk about the Sphere concert thing, and I didn't know anything about it, but it was like they were doing some uh, this, uh, oh, yeah, construction. This is just, like, this, this is giant, like, ball. Oh, is that all it is? Well, it's got some kind <laughs> I of think it's supposed to be, like, off. Awesome. show inside. I don't know that you yeah. go outside. I don't know exactly what it is. And which, Super high tech, so it's gonna be cool. But I, that's all I know. It'll be an you ideal place to see a concert. Yeah, super high tech, supposed to be cool. All right, I also want to see that's the views exactly over here. What I said. Yeah, yeah. Say, let's look over here. And it's easy to walk around too. It's not like it's a bumpy ride or anything. But yeah. So, oh, there's a glare. Last time I had the sun right in my eyeballs. So. Let's, uh, there you go. There goes the monorail. That's one fun ride I'd like to do. Yeah, we Although it's not a free chair. ride, but it'll it's take you, what, the MGM Grand to... All the way to the Sahara. That's pretty far. And you can do an all-day pass for more than five bucks. I mean, it's more than five bucks to do, like... Five bucks is a one-way Well, if you're trying to pack in the whole day of labor, that's what you want to Because your dog's... Never make it you don't far. want the dogs to be tired. Yeah, how about this? He's talking about escorting services. I don't know why. I know it's Vegas and all, but why are you That's talking not, about escorting? I, because I, oh, I have to have an escort at work. Sure you do. Yes. Sure. Yes. Sure. Not that kind of escort. Yeah. An arm, yes. Isn't it wonderful to work in Vegas? Yeah. 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 Oh, so for some reason it stopped. So now, now this place is telling us to party it up. <laughs> so that, that's a good way to not freak us out. But yeah, no, this thing does not stop. It goes so slow, you don't have to stop to um, put people in. Unless it's like, um, I don't know, maybe there's an assistance needed to like, load somebody. So, it's kind of like the doom buggies at Disneyland. They don't stop. They don't stop every few Nah. So here's our view so far. I love the cityscape of the flat and you just see all the lights for miles and that beautiful mountain silhouette. That's so, so you pretty. You really get a sense of that when you go to, to the stratosphere. You can see oh, the, light, the sure. city lights. You can from see that, the city lights and then on the just pitch drop. Yeah. Because that was 20 years ago. So I'm sure it's the same because we are in Boulder City. Yeah, it's like, the, oh my God, it's pitch dark really over there. The last 20 years. So that, that outskirts is practically all the way out to the mountains. The valley's almost full. That's true. Where um, it wasn't. Oh, now we're moving again. Here we go. Yeah. But no, like we're coming back from uh, 
like Boulder City area home at night and it was so pretty because you could see all these lights and uh, where we used to live it was hilly so you didn't get that view you just had a mountain like right away hills right away so you didn't get this beautiful like silhouette of city lights but yeah right there I'm seeing that construction right there that must be it what for what that sphere concert I think it's going right there. I don't know. What is it? Oh, oh, oh yeah, that big circle right yeah. there. I see it right there. Yeah, that must be it. Huh? Well, the person that commented down below last time when I was on this thing and they were asking, why didn't you talk about that? Because I said I didn't know about it. Well, if you're watching this, please tell us about it. <laughs> that very well could We're not just be, uh... clueless in Henderson. We're clueless in Vegas, too, okay? So it gives me the disclaimer to have no clue what I'm talking about. and I'm not factual. Alright, definitely I recommend going at night. The views are beautiful at night, so... Yeah. We actually have a little bit of the sunset. You can see the sunset. Yeah, I'm going to get that for you guys. Right? And we are almost at the top. Let's see. Yeah. Does it tell you when we're at the Yeah, it says it on the screen. It said we're at 500 or something. Oh, they will. Okay. Wow, look at that. This is like a perfect, this is Steve, this would be a perfect like a uh, picture, like that long picture I want in the yeah, house. Know, that is beautiful. Wow. Well, maybe we can get that into it. That's what I'm saying, like turn it into like a big, mm -hmm. yeah. I remember when we were first week Art House was in escrow and someone said, and I said, I think I'm going to miss our view in your Belinda. He goes, we got views in Henderson too. I'm like, oh. I'm like, we have better views than Henderson. I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, and you can see the uh, Luxor light right over here. That's amazing. I'm getting a glare over there. Oh my gosh, look at that. I see the bar car over there. The bar car is on the top right now. Oh, they just turned it purple? Yeah, the purple ones, are, there's two of them on there. All right, here's the views over on this side. So we're looking at Henderson now. It's amazing. It's miles and miles of lights. Tower, the Eiffel Tower? Oh yeah, we've never done that. No, there's so many things we gotta do. Yeah, there's so many cool things to do. All right, so we'll see you at the top. Here's the countdown here. For, we're supposed to be at 550 feet, so here you go. Forty-six stories. Yeah. Everyone's gravitating to this side. So I think I'll stand on this side just to make it equal. <laughs> Get your cocktails ready, people. Oh my god. We're almost there. Right here. Oh yeah, look at Yeah, they usually do it. 
Oh yeah, there are the oh yeah. Look <laughs> at little disco lights on that thing. That's <laughs> cool. Us next. I want to see my disco. Oh, look at it. We're getting there. Look at it. Starting the blinky blinky. Second. Such a weird dynamic watching that. Alright, let's go back these. Once again, can't get enough of them. Eight. Eight. Mm -hmm. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. This party is over the top. seen enough of it. Nice. I wonder what song they're singing. That'd be funny if it was going towards this song. <laughs> it would be funny. <laughs> but I like how the Paris, the, yeah, uh, the tower, that. like kind of goes, I don't know if that's on purpose, but it yeah, seems sure to. it is. I got a chance to sneak over on this side of things. I just wanted to show the view here because I really thought the Luxor looked kind of cool all lit up like that. The green. Oh, and I didn't realize the Bellagio light, there's like three lights there. We're doing good. Look at that, that's kind of cool. Actually, let me zoom into the Luxor as well now that I'm, there we go. Ah, look at, get the disco on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, before we exit our trip here off the high roller, Steve bets dollars to donuts that this is part of the convention center. It's going to be a convention center construction. For this hotel. He bet bets you. dollars to donuts. Though. Dollars to donuts. Dollars to donuts. And just like Disneyland's rides, they drop you off into the souvenir shop. Enjoy your ride. Enjoy, Enjoy your, your ride. Put them in sense and thoughtles. Sports for this. All right, we see some zip liners getting strapped up and ready to go. So let's catch them in flight. One thing I noticed, it sure seems to take a long time for them to prepare them for flight. So if you're all like busted drunk up there, like waiting to go, woo, yeah, you'll probably be sober by the time it's your turn to fly. Just but a at saying. Least be a good but at least you're going <laughs> to, yeah, at least you'll live through it. <laughs> you'll you'll uh, find your way to the very end there. <laughs> While we wait for the zip liner, Steve is saying a hat store is called a haberdashery. What? Haberdashery. It means what? You, it means you sell hats. It's a hat store. It's a haberdashery. It's a haberdashery. Oh, there they go. There they go! You can't see them because it's pitch black yeah, and they're dark, <laughs> on dark, and uh, uh, one, well, two, you see three, a dot or two. Five, five out of nine. Alrighty. And there they go. They don't go that fast compared to some of the other ones I've seen. Probably because they're higher up than Fremont Streets? I don't know. I don't know. There you guys go. Enjoy the zipline ride. Alright, that was a lot of fun, guys. I yes, hope you was. enjoyed it as much as we enjoyed it. So, thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye, everybody. Bye.